by Rokter Akinsi completes first shot test with the new ammunition MAM-T. By Rokter Ak which was developed by Baykar with domestic and national systems successfully completed the first firing test on April 22, 2021, with the smart ammunitions MAM-C, MAM-L and MAM-T, which were developed nationally by Rokezon. By Rokter Akinsi performed firing tests with the Rokezon's products MAM-C, 1 MAM-L. The first flight of the flight test campaign was conducted on 17th of April with the prototype PT-3. The second test flight with ammunition was conducted on 21st of April, and the first shots were conducted on April 22, 2021. During the test, Akinsi with laser targeting succeeded in hitting the targets with a full hit. MAM-T used for the first time By Rokter Akinsi's first shot test with the MAM-T, the new member of the MAM, Mini Intelligent Ammunition, family developed nationally by Rokhazan, was used for the first time in this test. Developed to meet the need for higher warhead efficiency and longer range, the MAM-T Block 1 configuration has ammunition and a semi-active laser seeker head that provides high sensitivity against moving and stationary targets. Developed to be compatible with different platforms, MAM-T can be used against armored and unarmored vehicles, buildings and surface targets with 30 plus km range capability in WOBs. Dreams or Lancet, the reality is MAM-T. In the MAM-T, Smart Micro Munition, promotional video published by Rokhazan, the Russian Panzer S-1 air defense system was simulated as a target. The effectiveness of Rokhazan MAM family ammunition against threats on the battlefield, especially Russian air delivery systems, has been recognized worldwide. Baycar Defenses by Rokter TB2 was used as the target aircraft in the promotional video of the Zala Lancet Kamikaze UAV published by the Russian state television and radio company VGTRK. In the air-launched concept of the Zala Lancet Kamikaze UAV, which was developed by Zala Aero, a part of the Kalashnikov group affiliated to the Russian public institution Rostec, the TB2C HA version of by Rokter TB2 was targeted.